Hello, my dear. <clears throat> I'm very sorry. The pop our power supply just came back. Okay. Okay, sorry. Okay, so now let's start. Oh, how are you, by the way? Good morning. Uh, good morning. I'm good. Okay. How was your Christmas? What? Oh, how was your Christmas? Uh, it is great. Uh-huh. Oh, do you celebrate Christmas? No, I don't. Oh. Oh, I see. Oh, most of the Vietnamese don't celebrate Christmas? No. Oh, I see. Wait a moment, please. Okay, okay. Hello. Okay. 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 Okay, hold on. Hmm. Uh, we are on unit one, right? Okay. Okay, so now um, let's talk about leisure activities. Okay, do you know what is leisure activity or leisure time? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay, very nice. Okay, so um, I just want to know... Okay, so what are the things that you usually do during your leisure time? What? Uh, uh, what? Uh -huh. Oh, can you please repeat again? Okay. Uh, what are the things that you usually do during your leisure time? I'm always watching TV uh, on free time, uh, on leisure time. Okay, um, you often watch TV and? Yes. And sometimes I play games. Oh, you play games, nice. Oh, what, what kinds of games? Uh, I play a football game. Oh, football games? A oh, football game? Hmm, yes. that's nice. Okay, so you play football with whom? What? Okay, <clears throat> you play football with whom? Uh, uh, I just play alone. Oh, you play alone. <laughs> okay. Now let's have this one. Okay. So tell me if there is a word that is unfamiliar with you. Okay? Yes. Okay. Are you sick? No, I'm not. Okay. Uh, what is this word? Can you read this one for me? Okay, very good, my dear. This is... Communicate. Okay, very nice. Communicate. Communicate. Okay, very good. And this is? Craft. Very nice. What about this one? Improve. Okay, improve. Improve. Okay, very good. And this is? Leisure. Uh-huh. What about this one? Melody. Okay, very good. Now, my dear, I want you to choose one word 
and use it in a sentence. And my mom was like, my dad uh, gave my bracelet to my mom. Okay, very good. <clears throat> okay, now <clears throat> let's have a look on this one. Okay, are you familiar with verbs? Uh -huh. Do you know what is verb? Okay, very good. Uh -huh. What about the verb of liking? Mm -hmm. Do you know what is a verb of liking? No, I don't. Mm -hmm. What about the gerunds? Uh huh. Uh, do you know what is gerund? No, I don't. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Ah, uh, hold on. Hello. Okay, sorry. That was my manager. Um, she's calling because. Yeah, you waited so long. I am very sorry. Okay, I think you know what is a gerund. Hold on. But it is written in English, so you are not quite familiar with it. Okay, let's see. Okay, this one, my dear. This one. Have you... Um, This one, familiar with this one? Yes. Okay, very good. Uh, in your language, this is gerund. Okay, but in English, gerund. Okay, now. Okay. So for the grammar part of this lesson, we are going to talk about the verbs of liking plus the gerunds and verbs of liking plus the infinitive form of the verbs. When we say infinitive form, this is the dictionary like. Okay, example. Yes. Uh, okay. Oh, you are familiar with that one? You already know that one? Yes. Okay, very good. So, uh, if we want to follow a verb with another action, we must use a gerund or an infinitive. Okay, so, but before that, okay, let's have this one. Uh, so, I will let you listen first and then we will read this one later, okay? Yes. Okay. Unit 1. Leisure Activities. Page 6. Getting Started. Activity 1. Listen and read. Check out this book, Fup. My Mini Guide to Dog Training. Sounds great. Max will like it too. Last weekend we learned some tricks. I love to watch him. It's so much fun. Have you found your craft kit? Yes, I've found this one. It's got everything. Beads, stickers, wool, buttons. I don't know. It'll take all my savings. But it's right up your street. Nick, what's that? It's a CD of Vietnamese folk songs. I'll listen to it tonight. And? You'll be able to improve your Vietnamese. Ha ha, not sure about that, but I think I'll enjoy listening to the melodies. Look at the language website I sent you. 
It'll help you learn Vietnamese more easily. Yes, I liked reading Doraemon comics while I was learning Japanese. Stop reading comics. I'll bring you my favourite short story this Sunday when we play football. Sorry, but we have to hurry. Mum and Dad are waiting. We need to buy some tools to build a new house for Max this weekend. I'll give you it. So, mm -hmm. let's uh, practice reading. I will read the parts of my, and you will be a uh, book, okay? Yes. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, so ready? Uh, check out this book, book. My mini me guide to dog training. Sounds great. Max will like it too. Last weekend, we learned some tricks. I love to watch him. It's so much fun. Have you found a craft kit? Yes, I found those. I found this one. It's got everything. Beads, stickers, wool, buttons. I don't know. I'll take all my savings. Max is right up your street. What's that? Nick is a CD of Vietnamese folk songs. I will listen it. I will listen to it tonight. And you'll be able to improve your Vietnamese. Ha <laughs> ha! Not sure about that, but I think I I can't see because wait. Mm -hmm. You can't see because. Oh, okay. Ha ha. Not sure about that, but I think I will enjoy listening to the melody. Look at the language website I sent you. It will help you learn Vietnamese more easily. Yes, I like reading. The Ramon comics, why I was learning Spanish. Stop reading comics. I will bring you my favorite short story this Sunday when we play football. Mm -hmm. Sorry, hold on. Sorry, but we have to hurry. Mom and Dad are waiting. We need to buy some tools to build a new house for Mox this weekend okay very nice my dear good job but could you please repeat this one okay again short okay one more time short short okay very good again this is short okay and what about this one my dear language okay language language Okay, very good. Okay, now for comprehension check. Uh, can you tell me what is this all about? Uh, mm -hmm. It is about uh, they are my uh, some book. Mm -hmm. uh, is and they are talking a lot of about listening to a CD, reading mm -hmm. comics, or language. Okay, uh huh. They are talking about listening to some uh, Vietnamese folk songs and. Comic. And comics. Okay, very nice. Oh, but where where did my and book going? Uh, they are going to the, li the library. Mm -hmm, they are going to the library. Okay, so what else? What about Max? Who is Max? I think Max is uh, some friends. Mm -hmm. Max is? Some friends. Oh, some friends? Okay, are you sure? 
Okay, yeah, Max could be their friends, but do you think Max is a pet or a person? I think it's a person. Oh, a person? Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh, my dear, I think Max is a dog. Okay, so look at this first, mm -hmm, this one. Check out this book, My Mini-Me Guide to Dog Training. Okay, sounds great. Max will like it too. Last weekend, we learned some tricks. Okay, so from this one, a uh, book is teaching Max some tricks. Yes. Okay, and then on this part, uh, mine says that they need to hurry because uh, they are going to buy some tools for Max's new house. Yes. Okay, very nice. Okay, so let's have this one. Okay, so circle the correct answer. Mm. Book my and Nick are in library, bookstore, or sports club. Okay, number one, where are they? Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Okay, are you finished? Yes. Okay, so what is your answer on number one? Number one is bookstore. Okay. What about number two? Number two is crab kit. Ooh. Okay, what about number three? Number three is dog. Okay, very nice. And number, number four is uh, CD. Okay, it's casket. Yes. Okay, number five. Number five is folk music. Okay, very good. Number six. Number six is Vietnamese. Okay, very good, my dear. Good job. Okay, so now let's have this one. Okay, which leisure activities do you think Pok, Mai, and Nick have? Tick the boxes, then find the information from the conversation to explain your choice. Okay, so let's start with book. Mm -hmm. What do you think are the leisure activities that a uh, book have? I think it's pet training. Okay, pet training. What else? Oh, <laughs> God bless you. <laughs> Making craft. Okay, up uh -huh, for book. A uh, pet training, making craft. Okay, what else? Uh, please, no. Uh, reading. Mm, reading, okay. Okay. 
Okay, very nice. What about my? My is making craft. Mm -hmm. Making craft. Okay. Uh, listen to music. Uh, listening to music. Okay. That, okay, that's it. What about Nick? Nick mm -hmm. is uh, learning language. Okay, so learning language. Okay, what else? Uh, reading. Mm -hmm. Reading. And listen to music. Okay, listening to music. Okay, very good. Uh, my dear, can you please um read this one for me? Number four. Listening to music. Okay, very good. One more time. Listening to music. Okay, good job. Okay, so why do you think uh, pop leisure activity is pet training, making craft, and reading? Uh, because mm -hmm. he talked about his pet and uh, have some chick. Oh, uh huh. He, he talked about his pet and. And they are uh, learn some chick. Oh, learning some trick. Yes. Okay, very nice. What about mine? Why do you think making craft? And listening to music is uh, her leisure time. Because he is talking about a sea. Oh, no. He is talking about a making craft. Mm -hmm. Okay. And listening to music. Uh, uh. I think that. Okay, uh, what about Nick? Why do you think reading, listening to music, and learning language is Nick's um, leisure activity? Uh, because Nick says he is like to listen to uh, the folk music and he is uh, learning uh, Vietnamese. Okay, very good, my dear. Okay, but uh, uh, can you please repeat after me? Because he said, uh -huh, because he said that he likes to learn, okay, learn Vietnamese and listen to music okay very good okay okay uh-huh yes oh so folk also like playing sports uh, can you guess what? what mm -hmm, can you guess what sport is that? Can you still remember? Mm, no, I don't. Okay. Okay. So as Nick and helping parents. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Let's see. Okay. Mm-hmm. So here, can you tell me what is that sport? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, so what is that sport? Uh, it's football. Okay, very good, football. Okay, 
Okay, now let's have this one. Okay, so this one is um, complete the following sentences with the words in the box. In some yes. cases, more than one answer can be relevant. Mm -hmm. uh, one is relaxing. Okay, one is relaxing. Mm -hmm. What about number two? Number two is... Mm -hmm. I think number two is resting. Oh, number two is relaxing. Okay, very good. Okay, what about this one? Mm hmm. Good. Okay, let's see. Ooh, that is exciting. Yes. Okay, okay. Uh huh. And number three. Oh goodness. <laughs> oh, do you want to blow your nose first? No, I don't. Okay. Oh, I think it's fun. Okay, number three is fun. Okay, very good. Uh -huh, number five. Uh, three is boring. Okay, four. Four is boring. Uh -huh, four is boring. Okay, what about number five? Number five is good. Okay, number five is good. Okay, very good. Now, um, I want you to read this one together with the correct answer. Okay, number one. Do you do leisure task activities in your free time and make you feel satisfied? Okay, very good. You can do relaxing activities such as as yoga or exciting ones such as mountain biking or skateboarding mm -hmm. hobbies such as making crafts or collecting things are fun okay. you can surf the internet but some people say this is boring mm -hmm. you can spend time with family and friends or become a volunteer for the community. This will make you feel good. Very good. Oh, but this one, my dear, can you please repeat this one for me? Sat. Okay, one more time. Sat. Okay, okay, my dear. Uh, you tend to pronounce this one like this. Sat. 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 Okay, okay. This one, my dear, is such. Okay, one more time. Such. Such. Okay, one more time, my dear. Such. Such. Oh, I see. Okay. So when you pronounce that one, that is the sound of ch, ch at the end. Can you? Mm -hmm, very good. Can you repeat? Uh -huh, can you repeat after me? Ch. Okay. Ch. Good job. Now let's put it. On word, such. Such. Okay, very good. One more time. Such. Mm -hmm. Another one. Such. Okay, good job. Okay. 
Okay, now let's have this one. Okay, so look at the following pie chart. Okay, so this is a pie chart on leisure activities in U.S. and answer the questions. Okay, so this one. Can you see this one clearly? Yes. Okay, very good. Nice one. Now, uh, number one question is, how much leisure time did people in U.S.? Mm -hmm. They, they, uh, have seven. Okay, they have. They have seven activities. Oh, yeah, they got. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, very nice, my team. They got, hold on, they got seven leisure activities. Okay, but my dear, um, how much, how much oh. is their leisure time? All in uh, all, in they, total. They have 5.1 hours. Okay, so they have 5.1 hours of leisure time okay so do you think 5.1 hours of leisure time is too long or too short uh it is too long oh it is too long oh, how about you how much leisure time do you have in a day uh i just have two or three hours. Mm. Oh, do you think your leisure time is too long or too short? I think it is uh, normal. It, it, oh, it is normal. Okay. Just the average. Yes. Okay. Very nice. What about number two? Uh... What did they do in their leisure time? Okay, the activities that they have during their leisure time. They are relaxing and thinking, uh, using the computer for leisure, mm -hmm. doing sport and exercise, reading, socializing, and communicating. Okay, very good. Uh huh. And watching. TV. Okay, and, and they have some other leisure activities. Okay, very good, my dear. Um, mm -hmm. Can you please repeat this one, my dear, for me, these words? Exercise. Okay, and this is? Socializing. Okay, very nice. Socializing. Okay, what about question number three? Mm. Uh -huh. What were the three most common activities? Uh, the most common activity is watching TV. Okay. What else? Three. And watching TV. Socializing and mm -hmm. communicating. Okay. Socializing and communicating. And using the computer for leisure. Okay, very good. Okay, uh, in, in your country, what do you think the leisure activities of people in your country? Uh, it is watching TV. Uh, watching TV. Uh, aside from watching TV, what else? Um, they are just playing games on the phone. Uh, sometimes they have some sports. Oh, okay. So playing uh, games, mobile games, and uh, sports. Yes. Okay. 
Okay, very good. Now, okay, so complete the table with information from the pie chart. Oh, but you have your book with you, right? Oh, you don't have a book. Okay. Uh -huh. Now, name here, you put the name of the activity and then the birth. Okay. Yes. Uh -huh. oh, do you want to see the pie chart again? Or you can answer this one without looking at the pie chart again. Uh, I think looking at the pie chart. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. There we go. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, name of activity is thinking and mm -hmm. verb is think. Oh. Okay, very nice. What else? Uh, using uh, the name of activity is using and the verb is use. Okay, very good. A name of activity is watching, verb is watch. Mm -hmm. A name of activity is doing, uh, and verb is do. Mm -hmm. Name of activity is reading, verb is read. Okay. Name of activity is socializing, uh, verb is socialize okay a uh, name of activity is communicating uh, and the verb is communicate mm -hmm. okay that's all yes okay uh, one more time I did. Uh, it's communicating communicating very good okay very nice Okay, um, can you use your annotate? Do you know how to use your annotate? So you could write on my screen like this. Uh -huh. do, you, you, do you know how to use your annotate? What? Uh -huh. Do you know how to use your annotate here on Zoom? Yes. Okay, very nice. Okay, uh, next time, my dear, uh, if it is writing, kindly write your answer, okay? So you could exercise your writing skills, okay? Okay. Okay. Okay, now this one. Okay, look at the words, match them on the category labels. Okay. Okay.
Okay, okay, very nice. Okay. Oh, you, you sent it on chat. Okay. I had number one. Okay, number one is E. Okay, number two is B. Uh, number three is F. Uh huh. Number four is A. Oh, let me see. Okay. Number five is D. Okay. Number six is H. Uh huh. Number seven is C. Okay. And number eight is G. Okay. Okay. Very nice. Mm -hmm. So, this is pronunciation of cluster uh, mm, the blending of the letter B and R and C <coughs> and R. Now, let's listen first and then we'll find out how to blend these two words or these two letters in a word. A closer look, one. Pronunciation. Activity five. Complete the words under the pictures with bra or pra. Listen. Okay, again, my dear, what is the sound of these two words, uh, these two letters when they are blended together? This is? Bra and pra. Okay, very good. Listen to check your answers and repeat. One. Apricot. Two. Bridge. Three. Bracelet. Four. Bread. Five. Princess. Six. President. Seven. Present. Eight. Broccoli. Okay, now it seems like you, you do the activity while listening. Uh -huh. So I complete, I give very good, complete the words under the pictures with the blending of pra or pra. Okay, so uh, listen to check your answer and repeat. What about on number one? Let's start with number one. It's pra. Okay, very good. Number two. Uh-huh. Number three. Bra. 
Okay, number four. Bra. Uh huh. Number five. Bra. One more time. Number five. Bra. Mm hmm. Number six. Bra. Okay, number seven. Bra. Number eight. Last number. Uh, is bra. Okay, very nice. Okay, now, uh, can you please read this one for me, my dear? Apricot. Okay. A bridge. Uh-huh. Bracelet. Very good. Bread. Okay. Uh, princess. Uh -huh, this one, my dear, number eight. Uh, broccoli. Okay. Present. Uh huh. Present. And this is princess. Very good. Okay. Now. I want you to choose one word and kindly use it to make a sentence. Mm -hmm. Can you hear me, my dear? Uh, choose one word and use it in a sentence. Um, as money. Uh, no. Uh, I always eat bread when I go to school. Mm, okay, very good. I always eat bread uh, when... I go to school. Okay, very nice. Okay, so this is listen and repeat. So repeat after the audio, okay? Yes. Pronunciation. Activity six. Listen and repeat. One. She loves making apricot jam. Your turn. She loves making apricot jam. Okay, very good. Two. My dad likes making bread in his free time. My dad likes making bread in his free time. Very good. Three. Hien is our club president. Hien is our club president. Okay, one more time. This is? Hien is our club president. Okay, very good. Four. Mai keeps all her bracelets in a beautiful box. Mai keeps all her her bracelet in, in a beautiful box. Okay, box. Box. Very good. Five. You will need a brush if you want to paint your room. You will need a brush if you want to paint your room. Mm -hmm. Very good. Six. This is a wonderful present. Thanks so much. This is a wonderful present. Thanks so much. Okay, good job. Mm -hmm. Okay, oh, this is supposed to be right to correct form of verbs, but it seems like oh, the answer is already here. Okay, let's have this one. Okay, so there are six grammar mistakes in this email. Can you find and correct them? Yes. Okay. One is in the play. 
So, number one is... Okay, often play. Mm. Okay, so often, oh, this one, my dear? Yes. Okay, very nice. Uh, what seems wrong with this one? Okay, so enjoy do is wrong. Okay, very good. Uh, what is I e F I have homework? Oh wait, wait. What 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 part are you now? Uh, it's a place I e F I H I F homework. Homework. Oh, hold on. Homework. I but I don't want. No. Uh, it's uh, next to the two. Mm -hmm. Oh, this one. How? Oh, this is supposed to be how? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I will tell them that there are some uh, typographical error with this material. Don't worry. Okay, this is have homework. The next wrong is uh, I sometimes have my parents. Okay, I sometimes have my parents. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, this one is if I have homework, this one. Mm -hmm, that is typographical error. Okay. Uh, 
Uh, but I have spent uh, this one, but I hate. And okay. The food is mm -hmm. yes. Okay, the food is oh, is the food is delicious. Yes. Oh, I see. Now, my dear, uh, is there anything else um, that no, you no. think? Okay, that you think wrong. Okay. Uh -huh. Now let's see. Hmm. Okay. So the first one is uh, like do. Okay. Is this is what I like to? It should be like to do or like doing. Okay. Oh, and then enjoy do. Mm, very good. It should be enjoy doing. I don't have. Mm -hmm. I don't have. Okay, and then don't mind to do. Yes. Ooh. Okay, hate to spend. Okay, very good. I love it out. Okay, this one. Okay. Okay, let me see. Okay, now, uh -huh, I think you aren't familiar with your hands. Okay, when we say uh, the birth of liking, this is usually the birth of liking. Uh, it starts with the word like, and it sometimes follows. God bless you. Followed with the verb gerund. So gerund verb, they are usually the verbs that end with letters I and G. I and G here, I and G there, I and G, I and G, and I and G. Now, this is the infinitive form of verb. When we see infinitive form of verb, they are the two plus the base form of verb. Base form of verb. Okay, like this one. To do. Uh -huh, do. Okay, this is a uh, negative. Don't like. Okay, to do and hate, love, enjoy. Uh -huh. Base form of the verb, they are the verbs in their dictionary form. When we say dictionary form, you can see them in the dictionary as it is. Okay, are we clear with that one? Do you understand that one? Yes. Okay, are you sure? Yes. Okay, so do you have question for that part? No, I don't. Okay, no, you don't. Okay. Okay, now. Mm -hmm. This is communication part. Read the following article on the magazine. 14 website. Okay, um, can you please read it aloud for me? I love hanging out uh, with my best friend Helen in my 
<coughs> is my spare time like going window shopping? J4F, we also work as volunteer for an animal protection organization. Tomorrow, we are going to a farm. I'll give you. I'll give. Mm -hmm. This may sound weird. Weird? I, weird, but I adore cloud watching. Find an open place like on her back and look at the clouds. Use, uh, use, uh, Imagination, imagination, uh -huh. easy, D I L I two. Okay. This this year, my city is the European capital. Uh -huh. capital uh, European. 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 Okay, one more time, maybe. Uh -huh. European. European very good captain of Kutro. So last gone one. So last gone one because my born I go to our city community center center where we dance, paint and do drama and hope drama it okay uh -huh. hook i'm hook i hook okay. uh, i like doing sport i'm in my school football team but what i mostly do in my free time is help my aunt she has cooking classes for small groups of tourists uh, is WF for me. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, I have been fired up, educated, uh, uh -huh. addicted. addicted, addicted to the net. I just love sitting in front of the computer for hours, but now. My mom has says is is uh, I will start my judo class this weekend. It is okay. W B U. Okay. So um, are there words or letters that seems strange for you, like you don't know what? Are they? You don't know what is the meaning of those words or letters. Uh, I know that, but I don't remember. <laughs> okay, so uh, you use you use this um words this this form on texting J for fun. Okay, very good. Trust for fun. Uh, what about this one? I don't remember that. Ah, uh, it's okay, it's okay. Uh huh. Ah, uh, this one. Uh, I don't remember. Mm -hmm. uh, this symbol. Uh, it's, it's like a heart. Oh, it's it, it's like a heart. Oh, like a heart. Um, uh, uh, actually, uh, yes, this is like a heart. Okay, like a heart. Okay, it, it likes, uh -huh, it likes, love it, like that. Or I like it. Okay, uh, what about this one? W, W, B, U. Uh, I don't know. Mm -hmm. uh, this is new to you. Okay, what about this one? N U F F. Uh, I don't remember that. Okay, you don't remember, but you you are certain that you um have this one on your 
school. You just don't remember them. Yes. Okay. Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me clear all of this. Okay, now, um, what activity is mentioned and what does he or she think about it? Uh, do you want to look for the information on the previous page or do you, you can answer it without looking on it? I want to look in the paragraph. Okay, I want to look at the uh, paragraph. Okay, this one. Yes. Okay, let's see. Okay. Uh -huh. uh, the activity is mentioned. Uh, Emily is uh, go hanging out with her friend. Okay, so go hanging out with her friends. Really nice. Thank and you. she thinks it's, it's just for fun. Okay, very good. Okay, next. Uh, can you back, please? I don't okay, remember. Okay, it's okay, it's okay. Okay. Uh, how... Is like uh, cloud watching, and she thinks it's, it's so weird. Okay, so uh huh, she she think that uh, it sounds weird. Uh huh, but she likes cloud watching. Okay, very good. Lean is. Uh, Link is mm -hmm. uh, is dance, paint, and to drama at weekend. Uh, in two hour cities, community community center, and she love it. Okay, very good. Uh, Ming is like doing sports. Uh, and, but the most uh, he likes to do is helping uh, his aunt. Uh, and he thinks it's, it's fun. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Uh, Menu thinks menu is just like sitting in the front of a computer for hours. Uh, but now he will start. He will start a judo class. Uh, and I think he he is a. Uh, Oh, uh-huh. 
uh, do you think he is uh, bored without uh, we with through the class? Yes. Okay, nice one. Okay. Oh, by the way, my dear, this is Manuel. Manuel. Okay, very good. So, uh huh. Okay, let's see. Okay, so Emily. Mm hmm He likes. Okay. Okay, very good. Cloud watching. Mm hmm Very good. Okay, so uh, Manuel, he likes playing computer games and he is addicted to it. And for Judo, it's okay for him. That is on the latter part of the paragraph. Okay, now let's let's um shaken up a bit your memory. Hold on. Okay, this one. Okay, this one. Okay, uh, this one is easy. This one. Easy, what do you think is this one? Uh -huh. uh, do you? Do you like? Okay, uh, do you like? It or do you love it? Do you like it too? Okay, very good. What about this one? Uh, what? What? About? What about you? Very good. Okay. So now, um, do you have, you, do you text or chat with your friends? Yes, I have, but uh, we don't use that. Oh, I see. In, in, in the Vietnam, you don't have, uh, like, abbreviation for things. Yes. Oh, I see. Ooh. Oh, in the Philippines, I sometimes use this with, when I am chatting or... Uh, talking with my friends, but uh, since this is a, a, a informal conversation, mm, not much. Okay, now uh, let's have this. Read the text and choose the correct answer. Oh, by the way, were you informed that this is a one and a half hour class? Mm, I think yes. Okay, yes, very nice. Okay, so the net generation. Okay. So please read this one for me. Wang is watering his garden and can't wait to pick the prime fruit. He spent most of his spray time looking after the garden sounds great doesn't it but his garden is virtual one in today's world teenagers rely on on effect on technology on technology more than in the past this can be a problem because using computers so much may have harmful effect on both of on both their mind and body and body. They prefer watching TV and playing computer games to reading books. Perhaps because they don't have to think 
and emotions such as as such as much as much they don't join clubs or have hobbies and they don't play sports they sit in front of the computer all the time they don't get out the house even for a walk they are in a world that doesn't exist mm -hmm. why Huang now know the name of many plants and his English seems to be improving as he chat with his gaming friends from all over the world his parents are getting worried they want to get are even thinking of banning him from okay uh -huh, banning him from using computer okay now um before we go over with the next page uh do you agree that uh this generation or your generation is called the net generation I think is yes. Okay. Well, why do you think so? Because this is talking about uh, games and some of uh, is it good and bad? So I think the next generation is uh, the good choice. Mm, okay, so mm -hmm, very nice. Uh, or do you agree? Do you agree with? Uh huh. I uh, is is. Mm -hmm. Yes, I do. Okay, yes, it's okay. Now, uh, is it okay? Uh, in your own opinion, is it okay for Kwang? Mm, I think yes, he is. Uh, it, it's it is it okay for him to have what we call a virtual a virtual world i think if it is uh normal it's okay but uh he uh play a lot is can be a problem oh it can be a problem why do you think it will be a problem for him if he plays a lot because uh, his eye can be can his eye can be mm -hmm. have some things wrong and uh, uh, everyone uh, can't play with him because he always just sit in before the computer uh, in front the computer okay very good so um do you think that uh, it may cause him damaging his eyes yes okay because he is always sitting in front of his computer yes uh, very good uh, do you know someone who is like Kwang? uh i know a friend and his name is Kwang too Oh my god! <laughs> oh, this this might be your friend. Okay, so um, can you describe your friend, Kwang? Uh, he is uh play a lot of computer, but uh his friend his English is good, and he is friendly. Uh. And I like to play with him. Okay. okay. Oh, uh, do you think your friend Kwang, uh, it helps him to be fluent in English? Uh, it, the playing a lot of computer games helps him to be fluent in English? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, why, why do you think so? Uh, because he is just play game, uh, have uh, English, so his grandma 
can be good. Can be mm. better. Okay. Okay, no, so this is truth to correct answer. Uh -huh. Number one, the text is about uh, the teenager leisure time in the present. Okay, so letter B. Okay, what about number two? The text discusses I think uh, both of A and B. Okay, both A and B. Okay, very good. Wonderful. Okay, this one. Write the questions for the answers based on information from the text. Oh, I think, my dear, you should drink some medicine. <laughs> Are you okay? Okay. Is it cold in Vietnam today? Yes, it is. Oh, here too in the Philippines, we just, uh, the typhoon just passes by, so it's quite cold. Okay, number one, write the question for the answer based on the information from the text. Okay. Uh, is, is the garden, uh, is real? Mm -hmm. Is the garden real? Okay. Yes. Um, what about number two? Uh, 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 what of the negative of the computer game? Okay, so number two is what? Of the negative of the computer game. Okay, what is the negative effect? Negative. Okay. Okay, negative effect of computer games. Very good. What about number three? Uh, is there all? Is there uh go out? Uh, is mm -hmm. there? Uh, uh, go out. That is there. Go out. Mm -hmm. Or this one. Let me help you with this one. One. Okay, what about number four? Uh, uh, does the positive effect of the computer game? Okay, what, uh, uh -huh. what is the, the positive of computer game? Very good. Okay, good job. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. Okay. Uh -huh. These are, we got here the suggested uh, answer. Very good. Is the garden real? Very nice. Uh, what is the problem with using technology in your free time or the negative effect? Okay, it can also be. Okay. Mm -hmm. What leisure activity do teenagers do these days? Okay. And number four. Okay, so what are the benefits of using computer or what, what are the positive 
effects of using computer. Okay. Uh -huh. Aside, aside from the things that uh, mentioned on the text, what do you think are the positive effects of using computer? I think uh, um, is is uh, is is uh, not good for the mm -hmm. eyes and uh, if we don't go out, we can be uh, we can. Mm -hmm. Continue. We can be quick. Uh, if we don't uh, have some exercise and mm, and we can't. Uh, we can't talking with uh, another uh, another people. Uh -huh. uh, we, we, we can't communicate. Yes, uh, with the neighborhood. Mm -hmm. uh, I just think that. Okay, very nice. So that is the negative effect of using computer for you. Very good, my dear. Good insights. Now, what do you think? Uh -huh, what do you think are the positive, positive effects of uh, using computer? Uh, it can help we. It can help we have more friends. Mm -hmm. uh, learning more some English and know uh, a lot of about people. people. Okay, so uh -huh. it, it helps you to uh, have new friends, to learn yes. English, and yes. to know to know some people. Yes. Okay, very nice. Oh, do you have do you have uh, a friend in the internet? Uh, yes, I do. Okay, a friend in the internet that you don't see in personal, just in uh, the internet. I think, uh, yes, I do, but now we don't talk anymore. Oh, why? Uh, because I lost his nick. Oh, I see. You lost his account. Yes. Uh huh. I see. Oh, too bad. Okay. When, where, where did you meet that friend? Is it a boy or a girl? Uh, it is a boy. A boy. Where, where do you meet that friend? Facebook. Uh, I meet on Facebook. Mm, on Facebook. Okay. Very nice. Okay, let's have this one. Oh, 11 on 11.20, I will let you go, okay? Yes. So we got, mm -hmm, it's 11.30 now. Okay, uh, this is speaking part. Oh, this is role play. Uh, we are going to look for a solution. So, yes. Kwang, his parents, and his teacher are discussing the impact of using the computer. Play the following roles. Okay, so you are Kwang. You want to pursue your parents of the benefits of using computer. Okay, so I think I will be the parent and you are going to persuade me to convince me what are the benefits of using computer. Okay? Yes. Okay, ready? Yes. Okay. Uh-huh. Kwang. You are using computer again. You don't go out much. Uh, uh, using computer is good because I can have more friends and 
I can learn more about English. Mm, but you have to go out. You you also have friends outside the virtual world. Uh, I will go out later. So now I'm learning English. Okay, very nice. Uh huh. What about the uh, number two? You are Kwang's parent. You want to let Kwang know that using the computer too much can be harmful. You are thinking of completely banning him from using it. Okay, so you will be you will be the parent, and I will be Kwang. Okay. Uh, uh if you do if you watch the computer a lot, you can be your eye can be have a problem and your eyes can be a problem and if you don't go out side you can be weak if you don't have an exercise oh but dad i want to play i do have a lot of plants on my virtual garden uh, if you want uh you can have a garden in outside outside and this is better for you with and it is better for you okay mm, but do you think having a real garden is much better for me yes you can eat that and uh, you can learn more something about about the cheese and it and you can run and have some exercise with that okay very good oh you are quite a strict father <laughs> okay good job uh, number uh, third situation so you are Kwang's teacher you see both the negative and positive sides of using the computer. You offer a solution that can make both Huang and his parents happy. Uh, using computer is good because you can have more friends and your English is good, but is more better. But you learn the lot. the lot. Computers can be can be bad for your eyes. So if you if you use the computer, uh, you need you can you just uh use it when we when you need or uh don't usually you just use uh uh sometimes and. And uh, one hour for the day. Oh, thank you very much, teacher. I kept on uh, reminding Kwang not to use too much computer, not to spend uh, too much time on computer. Thank you so much for giving the advice. Okay, good job. Mm -hmm. uh, let me just... I have this one. Okay, so use a uh, computer often. Okay, so uh, my dear, I think usually is the, did not fit on that sentence. So you have this sentence earlier. Use computer usually. Uh, it should be often. Okay. Okay, so now let's have okay language notes. Okay, so giving an opinion. So these are the phrases that we use when we want to give our insights or our opinion. So uh, we can start with, I think that, uh, in my opinion, okay, and when you were asking for someone's opinion, you can use this question, what do you think? How do you feel about that? Okay, so agreeing and disagreeing. If you agree with someone, you can say, I agree with you. That's true. 
Exactly. And if you are disagreeing, you can say that I'm afraid I don't agree and I don't think so. So these phrases, agreeing and disagreeing, they are the polite, polite way on giving your opinion if you agree or disagree. Are we clear with that one? Mm -hmm. Oh, God bless you. Do you understand that one? Yes. Okay. Okay, so I think uh, huh, I can't give you this one as homework. Uh, do you have a messenger account? Yes, I have. Okay, very nice. Uh, oh, God bless you again. I will send you my contact details via mail and uh, please add me on Messenger because uh, we are in a different country, so I don't have that letters. I think I can't, I will not be able to see you and on Messenger. And, uh huh, I will send you homework, okay? Yes. Okay, so I think that will be it for today's meeting. Again, I am very sorry for that inconvenience. Let's just hope that it won't yes. happen again. Okay, so thank you so much, my dear. Goodbye. Uh, what is the name? Facebook. Oh, my Facebook name. Okay, hold on. Oh, let me share my screen with you so you could look. Okay, this one. This is my my Facebook account. Okay, this one. Oh. Okay, let me send you, okay, this one. My name on Facebook is Seresa Dakara. You can also search for me on Messenger. Okay. So if, mm -hmm, if ever that uh, you will not be able to add me on Facebook, you can just uh, message me on Messenger and then I will add you, okay? Yes. Okay, so thank you so much, my dear. Let's see each other again next meeting, okay? Yes. Okay, so before we end our meeting, do you have a question? Uh, no, I don't. Okay, no questions so far. Okay, that will be it. Goodbye. See you next meeting. Bye. See you okay. Again.